Hey guys, so I don't normally make videos when a celebrity dies, but I wanted to make this real quick, and I'm just using my webcam to do it, so it's not going to be long or anything too special, but, you know, I have made videos before when celebrity dies, of course MJ, you know, I made it about Gene Stapleton and stuff like that, uh, and Carl O'Connor, um, but anyway, I just wanted to mention, though I'm not a huge fan of Robin Williams, and never really was, I do like him. You know, and I I did grow up in his movies. You know, he was an, a good person, good actor. He was always able to make you make you laugh. You know, um, very funny. I know he meant a lot to a lot of people. I grew up with Mrs. Doubtfire and many other of his movies. So you know, he was he was a legend in his own way. Actually, one of the best comedians there was. So. I was shocked by his death. I didn't even know he had severe depression. That's very sad. And he died of um, asphyxiation. But, you know, it's very sad. I feel really bad for him and his family. If he had severe depression, I really wish somebody went and helped him. I don't know if he got help or not, but apparently it wasn't enough if he did, if he did get it. This happens too much in Hollywood. You know, celebrities get depressed because that's the life they lead. And a lot of them have terrible lives that they hide from the public. And they live with depression and potentially kill themselves. It's sadly very common. I wasn't going to make this video because, again, it's nothing that's like too big for my channel. I mean, he's a, again, I'm not trying to undermine his death. He's a great man and I'm very sad by it. But I don't make videos about every, I don't make stories about every single person dying, right? So that's what I mean. But the reason I'm doing this is because there was some stuff related to MJ that pissed me off. A lot of people know that a lot of fans really, really make me mad. The kind of things they say and the kind of things they do really upset me and really piss me off royally. And like many comedians, Robin Williams was one of many who made fun of Michael Jackson. Now, so, many fans cannot take a joke about MJ. I can because I have a brain, but many fans can't take a joke. And some of them who can't take a joke make sense. You know, if, if, the, if the, the joke is really bad, things like that. It can be understandable for not taking a joke. But he did very basic stand-up comedy about MJ. Nothing too terrible, you know? There's much meaner comedians than there was than Robin Williams, you know? He did a really standard comedy act about MJ. And name and I want to throw it, name a celebrity who has not done a comedy act about MJ. But anyway, I saw this comment... And I can't remember the exact quote, but it was a video on YouTube of one of his acts on MJ. And a comment said, like, Oh, you say these mean things about MJ? You must feel guilty. I'm glad you killed yourself roast in hell. Fuck you! I don't, I'm sorry to yell, fuck you! Just fuck you to hell. There are so many things wrong with that comment. Number one, you can't take a fucking joke. Number two, you tell someone that you're glad they killed themselves, even though it had nothing to do with MJ. And number three, you actually have the nerve to think that he killed himself because of this joke about Michael Jackson. Fuck you, you stupid asshole fanatic. I fucking hate fans like this. Idiots. When it comes to fans like you, I'm so happy that the haters make fun of us. Hey, anyway, whatever. Aside from that fucking dumbass and any other fan who thought the same way as them, Robin Williams, rest in peace. We will miss you. And we hope your legacy lives on through your movies and your memory. Condolences to you and your family. Take care, everybody.